Hi family, welcome to the Car Pathway of Cooking. Before we get started on this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss a single video. Hello everyone, welcome to the Car Pathway of Cooking. My name is Alicia. Today I am going to cook for you some pepper steak. And here are the ingredients that you need. The star of the show, I have choice top round sirloin steak. And what um, my husband did, he had the butcher to slice the steak very thinly. And um, this is about the size that we were going for. We didn't want anything thick. You can use any type of steak that you like, but we chose the choice top round sirloin. And the other ingredients you're gonna need, you have your vegetables, got yellow pepper, green bell pepper, red bell pepper, pepper, and an onion. And I'm going to use, for the dry seasoning, stir fry seasoning pack. I'm going to use some garlic powder, chicken powder, and I'm also going to use minced garlic. I have low sodium soy sauce, I have cornstarch, and I have a little water. And I'm also going to use some rice vinegar, and this is optional. You need a little oil, and you also need some black pepper. All right, with that being said, what I need to do first, family, is season. Season my steak, and I am gonna use my hands, okay? So let me wash them because I did touch the steak. Let me wash them because I don't want to touch the steak and then touch the seasoning, okay? The containers. Give me one moment. What I want to use first is the seasoning pack. I haven't made pepper steak in a long time. I think I made it once for my husband the garlic powder. I will put the measurements in the description box. A little chicken powder. The chicken powder is optional too, y'all. You don't have to use that, okay? I'm use some ginger, not ginger. You can also use ginger, but this is minced garlic. And have some black pepper. Okay. And what I want to do is go on and heat up my pan. You want to make sure your pan is hot, okay? You don't need a whole lot of oil. And we're just gonna fry. We're going to fry up the steak. But what I'm gonna do is use my hands, family, and um, 
mix it up. I think I'm gonna add a little cornstarch to this. Just a little bit. And it is, it is better if you season this, your steak, the day before. I wanted to season it the day before, but I wanted you all to see how I seasoned the steak. And you season to taste. may need to add some more black pepper. Okay. Just gonna let this sit here for a minute until the oil heats up. And we will be right back, family. Okay, we are back. I'm gonna add a little more black pepper. You can also add um, red pepper flakes if you want a little kick to it. I want to get this meat over in the pan and then I will cut up the vegetables. And the pan that I am using is a non-stick pan. But I like to put oil in my pan anyway. So I think this is hot because I can smell the oil. Yes, this is what we want. Are you gonna cook that or are you just browning it? I'm just gonna brown it. It's gonna cook because it's thinly sliced. Oh, okay. The butcher sliced it really thin, and I'm just gonna cook it until it's brown. I want to make sure that the meat is not pink, so I'm gonna continue to cook this, and then we will be right back. Okay, family, we are back for a brief moment. I just wanted to show you how the meat is coming along. I'm going to let it brown. Um maybe another minute or two, and I'm going to take it out of this pan and transfer it to another dish. And we're gonna start cutting up the vegetables. And I will be right back. All right, family, we are back. I'm just gonna transfer this to this, this dish. I've washed it and cleaned it because I had raw meat in it at the beginning of the video. And we like our steak well done. If you don't want yours well done, um, take it out when you feel like it's at the point where you want yours to be, okay? You want to try a piece, Jacob, to see if it's tender? Yeah. You got a fork or something. Yeah. Let me move this off of this um, iron, off the heat. Because I'm going to cook the vegetables in the same oil. I'll let it cook before I eat it. Okay. All right. All right, so in the meantime and the between time, what I want to do is cut up some vegetables and we're going to add them to the frying pan. How are you all doing today? It's good and tender. 
Mm. What about the flavor? Good flavor. Okay. Can you taste that chicken powder I put in there? I can't really taste chick, but okay. taste the garlic. Okay. You can use as much vegetables that you like. This is a, a medium sized onion. like steak, you just need to add a little soy sauce in the um, it'll be right. Okay, I got it coming. You can use any color pepper that you want yours, one in yours, and I'm going to try and slice them thin, as thinly as possible. Do the best that I can do, you all know. I'm going to go ahead on and cut these up the best that I can. And when I'm done, before I transfer them to the frying pan, I will show you. So I'll be right back. Okay, family, we are back. I got my oil heating up. It's the same oil that I cooked the um, steak in. And I have my bell peppers, my colorful peppers. And what I'm going to do, I'm just gonna cook them for a minute or two. I want them to be vibrant in color, and I don't want them mushy. I want them to have a little crunch to it. But if you want yours to be a little mushy, you know, cook it the way you want yours to be, okay? Just gonna cook, let that cook for a few minutes. And in the meantime, I'm going to take my soy sauce. I'm going to mix this together. Just a little, little rice filling. You don't need much. And this is just for sweetness. Okay? You can use, you can add a little sugar if you like. For sweetness. Or a little honey. One overboard. Okay. I'm gonna let this do what it do. Add the water and the corn sauce. And we're gonna mix this really well. Make sure there's no lump. I may end up adding a little water to it. I had to stop hubby from eating the steak, y'all. Sure it is. Sure was good. <laughs> it's good. Yep. Look at the colors, family. I want it colorful. Let me turn it down a little bit. Because I want to mix this um Sauce off and this mixture really well. Okay. I hope your day is going good. I 
I hope your heart is happy. Okay. And I want to welcome all the new subscribers to the family. Y'all just don't know, I really appreciate it. You all really have made this channel grow. I need more subscribers and family, please give me thumbs up. Give me a thumb up. And if you haven't already subscribed, go ahead on and do so, okay? We really appreciate it. Right now I'm gonna add the meat back to the vegetables. And like I said, our meat is not burned. It's well done, but it's not burned, family, okay? If you're, you don't want your meat well done, don't pick it well done. Okay, this is ready. And this is only gonna thicken this up. See, there's nothing left in the bottom. Mix it very well. Okay, let's get rid of that. Yes, we really appreciate it. And mom is so happy, y'all. Y'all been showing her so much love. So much love. With her peanut brittle. What month we did that in? That was, it was in November. So in any two months, she got how many subscribers already? No, she got uh, about 7,000, over 7,000 views. Views. There's people okay. looking. Views. Looking at the video. I think I need to add a little water, family. And keep the comments coming. Just now add just a little water. You smell that rice wine vinegar drink. Mm -hmm. Smells good. Yeah. Good, good too. Mm. I'm gonna um, plate this up. I'm gonna put the vegetables on top of um, a bed of rice. You use any type of rice that you like. You're gonna make this your own. You're gonna alter, alter this to your liking, okay? Look at this, y'all. This is what you want. Add as much vegetables that you like. If you don't want as much vegetables as I use, that I use, don't put as much vegetables, okay? Is there any other vegetable you can add other than the pepper and the onion? Well, this is pepper steak. Oh, okay. But if you want to add broccoli, you can. I'm going to go ahead on and turn this off because I want my vegetables to be vibrant in color and I want a little crisp on it. And the cornstarch has thickened it up a little bit too. But this is what we want. This is what we want, y'all. Let me plate it up, and I'm going to taste it, too. And we'll be right back. All right, everyone, we are back, and look at this pepper steak. Just look at it. The steak is tender, well seasoned. I haven't tasted it yet, but I'm gonna taste it for you. And I have it on sticky rice. You can use any type of rice that you like. But look at it, look at the vegetables. They're not overly cooked. They're not well done. And look at the glaze on it. And what I did, I cut up some um, green uh, onion. Put it on there. But let me taste it. Mmm, it's a good flavor. You can taste soy sauce and stuff. Mm -hmm. I can taste that um, rice, rice right. vinegar, just a little bit. You don't want to put add too much. This is good. Mm. Mm. 
the peppers still have a little crunch to it. Mmm. Got a little crunch to it. Like I want. This is good. One more bite, y'all. Mmm. These onions are showing out too. Subscribe if you haven't already done so, okay? Really appreciate it. We want to grow this channel. And the only way it's going to grow, family, if you are supporting us and making it grow, it's up to you. It's up to you. Mm. This is really good. Hey, the cameraman want to eat too. Are you going to eat? But, all right, <laughs> I got to let the, let the family taste it too. Come on, taste the steak, y'all. Mm. You want a piece of cameraman? Yes, I do. Yeah. <laughs> let me get cameraman a bite. You happy now? Yep. What's up? Good. Good, good. But y'all check out the um, peanut brittle candy. Y'all check that video out. Mother is so happy, y'all. She is so happy. She is showing out. Mom can throw down, y'all. But if you do decide to try the peanut brittle, I want you to keep this in mind. That microwaves and ovens, the wattage varies. Some maybe um, have a higher wattage than others, and it may cook a little faster or a little slow. So if you know that your microwave cooks a little faster, keep an eye on it to make sure that your um, um, candy doesn't burn, okay? But, mm, I had to take that bite, y'all. Try this pepper steak. Let me know if you tried it, how yours turned out. Make it your own. Add your seasonings to it that you like. I have a mouthful of rice, y'all. But try it. This is delicious. And go ahead on and subscribe if you haven't done so. And, as I always say, always stay humble and kind. And keep showing us love. Y'all just don't know how it lifts our spirits. Which our spirits are lifted, but... You give it an extra boost, and we appreciate it, y'all. That let us know that we're doing something right. I'm an amateur at YouTube, okay? And I am kind of shy in front of the camera, and this is out of my box to get in front of this camera and cook for you all. I love to cook, but this is new, cooking in front of the camera, but I'm enjoying it. Thanks to you all. But anyway, I'm going to end this video because Jacob giving me that look, y'all. Yeah. He's giving me that look. And we will catch you all on the next video. Much love to everyone. Y'all stay safe out there. And take care of yourselves and your families. And smile. Be happy, y'all. Life is too short. Make the best of every minute of every day. Okay? I'll catch you all on the next video. Love y'all.